So today I am so, so excited to film. So last night I was at Walmart just picking up some hair dye and I walked past the makeup section as I do every single time I go into Walmart and I found this baby. This is literally brand new. I have never seen it in a drugstore yet. Like, Walmart was the first time that I had ever seen this thing. It's by L'Oreal and it's called La Palette Nude 2. They So they have two of these. So one of them is kind of like the Naked 1 where it's a lot of gold tones, a lot of warm tones, and then this guy is... <sighs> this guy is a bunch of really, really cool, gorgeous, toned eyeshadow. I am so freaking excited. So today I'm going to do a kind of first impression review. I have swatched these, but I haven't tried them on my eyes. So I'm going to do a look using these and tell you what I think about it. So this guy was $16 rounded up. It was like $15.95. And like I said, there was two of them. And I'm so excited to play with them. So let's just, let's just get into play with them. Okay, so I already have primer on my eyes, so I'm first going to take this color right here for a transition color. This might be a little too light for a transition, but we will see. Oh, no, it looks, looks like it's going to be fine. Ooh, I'm so excited. I've been so into these, like, cool toned, rosy toned, purple toned eyeshadows lately. Oh, and I'm so excited that, like the drugstore is finally getting on the eyeshadow palette game and like I haven't heard that many good things about the Maybelline eye pal eyeshadow palettes so when th I saw this I flipped my lid so I'm just sloppily putting that all over my crease and into my outer V and I'm pretty much gonna do the eyeshadow look that I've been kind of gravitating towards but it's gonna be a little different because I'm just gonna use colors from this eyeshadow palette it's the one that I wore in my Steeler Skip of the Jordana matte lipsticks and the what, what's new at the drugstore video so if you guys wanted a tutorial for that one this is gonna be pretty stinking close alright and then let's see oh gosh so much to choose from so I'm going to take this purple here at the end and I'm gonna concentrate that on my outer V. Oh god, these are like pigmented. Do you see like the powder on here? <sighs> Whoa, little powdery, but that's okay. But like, look how pigmented it is. It's really, really pretty. All right, oh god, I don't know what to do next. I'm gonna put just a little bit more of that same purple on my lower lash line. Just adding more of that purple because I really want it like purple. This stuff builds really really nicely. I'm super super impressed so far. Blends out nice. Hasn't gone patchy. Oh, freaking love it. Alright and then I'm going to take hmm, I'm going to take this dark brown that guy right here onto a smaller blending brush or something like that and I'm gonna darken up the crease even more I'm so impressed holy crap like this look, this gives me the exact same effect as when I use like my Too Faced palette or my Smashbox Double Exposure palette. Like, I'm good job, L'Oreal. I am stoked. And then I'm also gonna take that same dark brown underneath my lower lash line. And like I said, if you aren't into cool tones, they do have a one that is all gold toned or like gold and warmer tones. Oh, I'm so excited you guys, oh my gosh. Alright, finally I'm going to take this first color right here, this kind of shimmery pink color. Oh, there it is. I'm just going to take that on my finger and pat that on my lid. Boom. What? Oh my god, you guys. Oh my god. I'm in eyeshadow heaven right now. Yes. Yep. Yep, done. I love it. I love it. And then I'm going to take that same color and I'm going to highlight my brow bone with it. 
Alright, let me just finish up my eyes with some eyeliner and mascara and I'll be right back. Okay guys, so mascara and eyeliner are applied and I am so freaking stoked on this palette. I think it is great. The only thing I did notice is when I was swatching him, um, the more pigmented ones like kind of balled up once I like put the swatch down so like there was kind of little chunks of eyeshadow but they blended away immediately it was nothing where it like became like actually chunky or patchy but that is something that happened I mean but still the colors in here are absolutely gorgeous they're all really really pigmented really blendable as you guys saw in the demo and I just think this is such an awesome, awesome product. I'm so excited that drugstores are coming out with good quality eyeshadow palettes because really the only option you have for good eyeshadow palettes right now are the expensive ones and not everybody wants to blow 50 bucks on an eyeshadow palette which is reasonable, you know? And so I think that if you are looking for some great eyeshadows, definitely pick this up. I found it at Walmart. I don't know if it's going to be at Walgreens or anything else but definitely keep your eye out for it. I think it is an amazing palette and I'm so so excited about it. So guys, that is all I have for you today. Please give this video a thumbs up if you want to see more reviews or looks for this um, palette. Let me know what you guys want to see next, and I'll see you later.